this is a double-edged sword for Hillary Clinton and her campaign. On one hand, there won't be any criminal charges, but on the other, it, it's a, a completely scathing uh, review by Jim Comey and the FBI. Uh, he said that uh, Clinton used uh, very uh, poor judgment here. That's something that no presidential candidate wants to have attached to him or her. I think all of these things are, are, are more and more examples of, uh, that lead people to think that the Clintons try to play by their own set of rules and that they, they get away with it. This makes it much harder for Hillary Clinton to make the trust argument. And the irony is that this is all coming hours before Barack Obama, the president, uh, her one-time campaign foe, is, is traveling with her to essentially make that argument, that she is the trustworthy candidate here, the person who we should turn the, the levers of power over to in the White House. Um, so it's going to be hard, and, and, and a big problem for Hillary is that this plays right into the hand, the argument that Donald Trump has been making. He's been saying that the system is rigged and you can't trust a Democratic administration to, to properly investigate someone like Hillary Clinton. I don't think that, uh, that Hillary Clinton is, is forever damaged by this and, and has no chance of, of winning the White House. I mean, battleground polls still show her ahead of Trump in a lot of the states that matter. Uh, he, Trump has very high negatives of his own. I, I think this is just going to be um, part of the discussion going forward. It's going to be hard for voters to just somehow separate this investigation out when they're making this decision. This is going to be part of the, the calculation.